when i listen my senses are far more heightened and my attention span is far more versus when i am reading so for me as a format it really worked our attention span is as short as an instagram story so podcasting initially for me was an attraction that helped me learn on the go hi guys we're going to talk about podcasting and Uh, my favorite podcast both for kids for families for business owners all of that now i am going to straight dive into why i love podcasting how i chanced upon and why i think it's great whether you're an adult whether you're a parent whether you're uh, in college or you're at a job or whatever else that there is i chanced on podcasting because i am a constant learner i constantly want to learn read no more about people so for me it was a very very natural progression to you know immediately stick to a format that would kind of you know help me learn on the go so podcasting initially for me was an attraction that helped me learn on the go let me tell you a little bit about how i chanced on podcasting so like i said i'm a constant learner and for me it was about it's just another medium and and why kids and parents should uh listen to podcast because we all have different different skills right we have visual skills auditory skills kinesthetic skills and for me when i often faced that when i was reading something my mind was and and i love reading for all of you all who are following me on my personal instagram page which is mansi rods very you obviously know that i read a lot but what was essentially happening was that sometimes you're not fully present and you have that moment where you your your eyes are on the book but your mind is someplace else right that's when i felt that i i wasn't using my listening skills as much as i was listening to um you know as much as i wanted to i thought that um it was kind of a you know when i when i listen my senses are far more heightened and my attention span is far more versus when i am reading so for me as a format it really worked also when my kids were very very little what really helped was that when i was reading to them i played the same audio book to them uh, so they became much faster readers instead of uh, because they already knew what was the same and and you know good old days we used to get the cd cd along with the book along with the read along book and and it used to be a lot of fun because that's how they learned to read very fast also it became a very very seamless way for us to put them to sleep uh, because sometimes you're not always there with your children and narrating stories or putting them to sleep or whatever so listening to an audio book or listening to a podcast kind of really really help podcasting for me is also about listening to other people's opinions uh, i often feel that we listen to not listen but to react when you are in a podcasting space like in that head space you learn to listen your listening ability improves significantly uh and i'm not joking try this if you don't chance upon a good podcast chances are you will hit next very very our attention span is as short as an instagram story quite literally it's as short as 15 seconds or sometimes as little as 3 seconds right we want to move on to the next story acha ye kya bol raha hai let's move on to the next story acha let's move on to the next story because we are not listening so for me podcasting really helped me listen to other people's opinions now i kind of listen to podcasts in the morning for news i listen to podcasts in the evening for um you know something which is more spiritual or something uh, which is more learning or more unwinding and of course learning to stories of and of course reading or listening to stories that the children may want to listen to so i would say do not keep or in the morning sometimes at at about 9 9:30 on my way to work you guys would know i am constantly listening to podcasts about work because it automatically tuned me to listen to what i need to know about my work so i could not possibly watch videos and walk on the road but i could listen to a podcast and and kind of walk around and and learn um, more about so it kind of automatically puts you in that mind frame um so that really really helped what i am going to share with you guys is a couple of key favorites that i have both for kids and for for business owners or or uh, you know all of us who are listening or watching this live right now the kids one i've made notes so pardon me because i'm going to keep looking at my notes what if world and it's an improvisation the improvisation storyteller mr eric 
tells fantastic tales based on what if questions submitted by the listener. And guys, you all have to bookmark this live um, because we're going to share some amazing recommendations and you really want to go back to these because as always on Kids Top Press, we, we drill and discover nothing but the best for you guys and we make sure that we, we, we spend so much time on researching every single piece that we share with you guys that it's totally worth a bookmark. Um, right, so the what if world is great. Uh, girl tales, uh, you can introduce your children to feminist fairy tales. Of course, there's a Rebel Girls podcast as well. If your kids have actually read the book, then a lot of you guys may not know for the Rebel Girls actually has a podcast. So do check that out on Apple Podcast. Coming to Apple Podcast, what I would really, really want you guys to do is please listen to the Kids Talk Press podcast on Apple Podcast or Google Podcast or SoundCloud or Spotify, wherever you may be listening to your podcast. And please, please subscribe and please give us a review, guys. We need all the love right now. We're already on the top 50 um, kids and family podcast. And we would absolutely need to keep maintaining that consistency. So we need your love and support. So we'd absolutely love if you guys can share a review and make sure that you subscribe because that can really help us work a little harder. So please. Um, okay, coming to the other podcast is But Why. Uh, this one again is on Apple Podcasts and you definitely want to listen to this with your children. It's the public podcast host um, Jane Lindholm helps answer kids most of the burning questions that they are going through at the moment so but why is fantastic dadi nani ki kahaniya by abhinav is a podcast for kids in hindi and you're going to absolutely love that where they share traditional stories that most of us grew up with now on kids press we also share a whole bunch of stories for children um with a little bit of a twist so make sure that you also read um, make sure you also listen to that for the parents okay and i'm going to share a few of the ones that i absolutely love michelle obama has launched her podcast on spotify so if you guys haven't heard that the first episode is with her and barack obama so you don't want to miss on that one i i heard and a lot of you guys when i shared that on my personal instagram asked me whether it's good it's worth a listen and and whatever i think for a first time podcaster she's done fairly well and uh, it's Michelle Obama. I'm a huge fan girl, so I, I would love to listen to her. I wish she would have tightened it a little, little finely tight, but she definitely talks about her growing up times as a child and what has shaped today and how the style of parenting of her mother and because they were part of a community growing up versus how she is raising her children today is fantastic. So you definitely want to listen to that. The other one, which is my absolute favorite, is the, the Super Soul Sunday which is by Oprah and again I love Oprah okay Peter uh, and she's fantastic her guests are fantastic she's also done with one now where she talks about the super soul tour and she actually has Jennifer Lopez she has um, she has Jane Fonda she has Michelle Obama and the one with Michelle Obama is an absolute absolute must listen she also does uh, with um, uh, you know with uh, um, with another very, very, very nice author, Eckhart, and I love his book. So if you are an Eckhart fan, you're going to love his podcast with Oprah for sure. Um, what I love from a business podcast perspective is something that I have detailed out on the KSP Mom Boss Bundle, and it's absolutely incredible if you guys haven't. A few of my favorites are The Marketing School. I also love News Laundry and NL Hafta for their podcast and their news opinions because I really do feel you need unbiased opinions um, in the news space. Everything is so politically driven that it sometimes doesn't give you a very, very, uh, it, it, they kind of taint the picture that you, they want you to see. And I feel that you need independent newsrooms to talk about um talk about the news that you want to actually uh, share and see um i love business war business wars by pondry again if you guys aren't following me on my personal instagram page i've shared all of this and make sure that you do follow because a large part of it comes from there then we have the tim ferris show um and that one is incredible as well because 
I've read his book, The Tribe of Mentors. If you haven't, then make sure that you do. He talks about some incredible stuff on on his show, and every episode is is a must listen. Uh, Masters of Scale by Reid Hoffman. Again, I'm a big, big Reid Hoffman fan. Uh, for everybody who's in the business space and would love to listen to him, and of course, if you guys are not already listening, make sure you listen to Raising Parents on Geo Seven because that's the original that I have conceptualized this year, which premiered in May, and and we've got over. Half a million views already on that show, so I really, really urge you guys to make sure that you listen to it and give us your feedback. We have new podcast episodes coming every single time. I know a lot of you guys requested for the Saurabh Pant extended, unfiltered version, and we've kind of got that on our YouTube channel. Um, so we we've, we've got that. So make sure that you definitely check out Saurabh Pant's video on our YouTube channel because he is. He lays. He is just. He's. He's absolutely fantastic, and I cannot. I can promise you, um, it's forty minutes of laughter straight, right? So, uh, find a good spot, a comfortable cup of chai, and definitely get um, get listening on that video because he's hilarious. Um, next up, I want to quickly before we wind up talk about uh, how and when and where do I listen to podcasts? I listen to them when I'm running in the morning. I listened to them when I was doing the dishes while we were in the lockdown. I I kind of listen to it um, sometimes in the night. I listen, but I in the night I don't listen to the business ones because it kind of wires me up and it's very difficult to then disconnect. Um, I listen to it uh, sometimes, uh, you know, when I am. Uh, walking to work when I used to walk to work. Uh, now it's largely confined within the house. But even if I'm walking in the building or anything like that, absolutely love to listen. Uh, make sure you listen to it with your kids because, like I said, it's a different skill that you're exploring completely. I personally feel my concentration skills, my focus skills, um, have gone up tremendously after listening to podcasts because. I've learned to listen. I also sense that with my children, I do feel that after they have started listening and hearing podcasts uh, or audio books, um, their sense of focus and ability to listen has tremendously improved. So I would totally recommend you guys uh, listen to it. And what I would absolutely love is if you guys can leave after this video, which we'll put back on our feed. If you guys can share with us the topics in the comments of. What kind of podcast do you want us to record? What is it that would really excite excite you? Who are the guests you want us to get on your show? Um, would totally would totally love that. So, what would be incredible, guys, is that please please leave the comments. Make sure that you subscribe to the Kids Drop Press podcast on Apple and Spotify, and give us a fabulous review. And of course, leave the names of the guests that you want us to get on Raising Parents and on Keep It Real. Um, both of which are on Apple and Spotify, and yes. And if you have any questions with regards to podcasting, I'm always there. And feel free to reach out to me. Make sure that you also follow us, follow me on my personal handle, because I may promptly reply to um, any of the comments or questions that you may have, which may be more specific in nature that you may have, uh, which which you know, in case you are looking at starting your podcast or any other questions that you may want to know. See you guys. Thank you so much. Bye.